What's a poppin' Pisces? Alright, so I wanted to tell you guys about this dream that I had. Uh, I had two dreams, actually. And I want you guys to tell me what you all think in the comments down below. I'm finally getting ready to eat, so please, please do not mind me, okay? So, first dream. I don't know what the fuck I ate that night. But the first dream that I had was I was on the ground and I woke up and my eyes opened. And my body was attached to my brothers. My biological brother, mind you. Right? I get up out of his body first. I look around and it's nothing but twins everywhere. It's different sets of twins, different um, hair types, different eye colors. I'm just looking around at all the twins. He gets up. He's every twin that I'm looking at, they're standing side by side. This is some sort of I it looked like a planet to me, full of twins. And they were brother and sister twins, there were uh identical twins, they were by um um they were all fused. Uh they were the twins that were fused together. Now, mind you, I'm adopted, and um, he's older than me by 10 months, to be exact. So, in this dream, I'm looking around, everybody has the same hair, or their twin has the same hair, same eye color, same everything. My brother finally catches up with me, and he's following him right next to me, side by side, like the rest of the twins. And then as I'm looking down on the ground as we all walk into some place, some misty place, I don't even know what the hell we was doing. We was it wasn't like we were robotic, but it was like everybody had a twin and everybody knew where they was going. So then I look down on the ground and I see my daughter. And then I see my son. And then I see another child again coming out of them making sets of twins. When I tell you, I have had fallen dreams. I never had nightmares. Y'all tell me what nightmares are to you because I've never had nightmares before. I even had to ask my kids, what is a nightmare? I've had fallen off a cliff before. I've had fallen down on trees, mountains. I've had all kinds of dreams. But in this one particular, it was a twin planet. The scenery was dusty but it was misty but it was still clear enough for us to all be able to breathe but we were all twins and and from the ground my children were formed that was the first dream second dream This one happened last night. And I usually do have a lot of phenomenons that happen in the dream. You know, I've had snake dreams. I've had fighting dreams while fighting animals and all kinds of stuff. Giants, sleeping giants. As I was making this food, it was something that was telling me, you need to tell them about your dreams. If anybody's ever had these dreams before or different planets or different um, galaxies, tell me in the comments down below. I've never had these dreams before. I've had multiple dreams that I remember. I wake up out of my sleep and I'm like, okay, bitch, 
you about to, uh, you gonna be ready for World War Two, you know, because of this dream, you know, or uh, something plays out in my life with the with the dreams that I've had before. Um, and a lot of them are a lot of Claire Audio, uh, Claire, Clara, Claire Audio messages. I've even smelled things in my dreams as well too. Uh, like when older people come around I smell coffee or roses or I can smell certain perfumes and stuff that was um, very uh, uh, popular back in those times or uh, I can smell blood you know I can go back to recessions a lot and in this dream in particular We had all, it felt like we were under sea, but we were still on earth. And we all met up with our twin, twins. Let me clarify the pair, let me clarify the S, okay? <laughs> Everything that we ate was all the same. Everything was the same. We shitted the same. We talked the same, but we were still different individuals from different families and different different tribes is what it looked like. The second one was It's just so crazy to me because I've had so many dreams before, but these are phenomenal dreams of different uh, travels and different parallels and different norms. But this one in particular had me like, oh, oh bitch. I think you can, I think you can unlock some weird shit. This dream, I ate lamb. The, the, I had lamb. I had some lamb and rice the night before. So I always make sure that I monitor whatever it is that I'm eating, depending on the type of mood that I'm having and what I, what kind of dream that I had, what's passing through my body as it's going through. Or say, for instance, if I say I'm gonna, if the whole family's gonna eat this cake, we're all gonna make three thousand dollars after we all pass it through our systems and our bodies. We had lamb. I had lamb. We all had lamb last night. When I tell you that there are certain signs and symbolisms and signals that certain people get that have different um, different paths and characteristics and and specialties and stuff like that um this dream was crazy i ain't even gonna lie to you um and me thinking about it is even more crazy because i've never had it before and most dreams i remember them i remember having them and where i was and what was happening in a 3D reality versus what was happening in a 4D. So, I get kind of puzzled because of I'm trying to figure out what it means. Now, I didn't tell y'all about that, about that mail dream, about how the mail was coming up to you. I'm dropping off your mail. It was like a robot postal service or some shit like that. You drop your mail off or whatever. Well, this one, 
this last dream that I had, like I said, I had lamb that I had lamb last night. So I don't know if that has altered because I really don't eat meat. I eat, I'm a pescatarian pretty much. I really only eat anything of the, from the sea. Uh, now I will have some, some fufu and some stew every now and again. But really, I just eat the vegetables out of it. So, a lot of that stuff that I put into my body, I really do analyze each little thing that goes into my body. Because like I said, you know, I'll bake a cake for us. And I'll be like, all right, by the time we all finish eating this cake, you know, kitchen magic. You know what I mean? Process magic. Um, so... We basically were sleep on this planet and when you would sleep on the planet you would be dead and it wouldn't even be dead but the whole planet was sleep sleeping and that they in their sleep they were in this planet on earth um, living out in their sleep now I don't know if there's any movies or anything out there if it is bitch they took it from me <laughs> so I've never heard anybody have this dream before and they were dead considered dead but they were uh, living they were asleep on the planet everyone was laying down um, and I just didn't I couldn't understand like okay so what y'all how do y'all live you know i was just there witnessing them sleep i'm still trying to process it y'all tell me what y'all think in the comments down below i might talk about it a little bit more but i have the the dreams that i have are absolutely uh, sometimes it takes me a few days to process um, what's been given and in that dream in particular baby it made me think it, it just made me really sit back and think I just didn't understand what it meant you know cause I be having troubles going to sleep okay like I can sleep good than a motherfucker but I still have troubles trying to put myself to sleep I still have insomnia when I have to when I feel like I have to do something or be productive I don't want to sleep my body doesn't want to sleep but when I want to sleep I told y'all are you rock bar if we on that plane bitch I'm going to bed okay I'm going to sleep if anybody talk about blowing anything up okay but just know that I just can't quite uh, process the dream um Tell me what y'all think in the comments down below. But like I said, if anybody steal that shit, they stole that shit from me, okay? If anybody make a, a, a Paramount, a Walt Disney movie, or whatever the fuck, bitch, they stole that shit from me, bitch. Yeah. But I've never had a dream like that. Uh, that was my first time having a t the twin planet dream and also um, the sleeping planet. Uh, and that's all that I can really say that I've seen, really. So let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. I'll see you guys in the next video.